Okay, welcome everybody to Shantae Half Genie Hero. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty goddamn excited to get into this game. Let's jump right in. Okay, seems we have like different modes we'll be able to unlock. Like that's obviously risky. Yeah, I'm ready too. Let's let's fucking get into this. Like I think it'll be good to know that I'm going into this completely blind. Like I have no prior experience to this. This is day one, of course. Huh? Is someone there? Hello? You know, if I heard strange noises outside, like I'd make sure my doors are locked and shit. Like, maybe I would peek? I wouldn't run outside like we're doing right now. Like, I think if nothing was there, it's just, like, something that's, you know, part of the atmosphere of the night. Like, think no nothing of it and go back to bed. Uncle oh, Uncle. You fell asleep in your workshop again. Huh? I've never seen that trap door before. I wonder where it leads. Like... Okay, any normal person... Would... Like, I would've just shut the fucking trap door. <laughs> and gone back to bed. Did... Did I just fu It... Did I just, like... Run into the enemy and it... Like... Oh, you... So you can get hurt. Apparently. Then what the, what the hell was with the other one? Do I just have to run it? What the hell was with the, with the first one, then? Like, why couldn't I kill the other ones? What is this place? Does Uncle even know it's down here? There goes that voice again. Welcome, daughter of the genies. Who, who said that? Whoever you are, you had better come out right now. Don't be afraid. Who are you? A messenger from the genie realm. <gasps> what? We haven't heard of that shit since the first game. I have summoned you here to warn you of a great danger. Very soon, an agent of darkness will strike at the heart of our world. It seeks to corrupt our magic and use it for its own selfish gain. With our power at its disposal, this agent of darkness will reign supreme over both our worlds, and no one will escape its wrath. Oh no, this sounds serious. How do we stop it? As a daughter of the genies, only you have the power to do this. Me? But how? Like, you've gone on three adventures so far, I think you would know. I will help you where I can, listen for my voice, and follow your heart as you always have. Just like the fucking song. Only then can both our worlds be saved. Wait, don't go! What about my mother? Is she there with you? I can barely hear you. Is she in danger too? Please tell me. Please, I have to know. Don't leave me. So what the fuck is happening right now? Like... Okay, the save guy has seen better days. Apparently. The, the girl next to me looks like fucking Princess Jasmine. Boy, oh boy. 
That was some crazy dream I had. No more comic books in bed from now on. That whole tub of cookie dough ice cream probably didn't help much either. Oh well. Now that I'm up, it's time to meet Uncle. He's probably at his workshop, knee-deep in gizmos and goo -gahs. Wow. Okay, looks like everything else is in order. We can still whip, we can run, we can jump. And the workshop is actually right here. B-Bun still talks to people. Let's talk to Princess Jasmine here. This is the item shop if you enjoy customizing your abilities. Okay. Hey girl, press Y to shake those hips. You fucking... What are you, you fucking, fucking gay? gay? You, like, starting to hit on me? Okay. That's pretty cool. Like, look how fucking fluid this animation is. So yeah, like, fucking animation seems really fluid in this game. Just like I've seen in trailers and stuff, and it doesn't disappoint in the actual thing. Good morning, uncle. Um, hmm. Say, I had the weirdest dream last night. And you can tell me all about it, but first, if your uncle mimic a hand, will you? Sure, is this something to do with your new invention? You'll see. I've got a mechanical part on back order. Should have arrived today. I sent your pal Bolo over to the item shop to pick it up. But he hasn't come back yet. Of course he hasn't. It's Bolo. That was over an hour ago. Of course. Always his head in the clouds, that boy. Would you mind picking up the part for me? Sure thing, uncle. Okay. So I guess we got to fucking... I already forgot where I was supposed to go now. Like, I'm just... I'm way too excited to be playing this Sky's Hatchery. Let's visit Sky, see what she has to say. Ah, that cool ocean breeze feels amazing. But I think we're in for another hot one. Good morning, Sky. Have you seen Bolo? Try the bathhouse. Last I saw him was heading in that direction. Like, bathhouse, yeah, and there he is. What are you doing in the bathhouse? Uncle's waiting for you to deliver his package. You're in the wrong shop, you numbskull. This woman, she's like a bad <laughs> angel. Oh, good gravy, not this again. Snap out of it can't look away. Never mind, I'll talk to her. Good morning and welcome to the bathhouse, a place where you can rejuvenate your body and spirit with a tranquil sound and sense of hardcore, white knuckle, full throttle, max relaxation. Normally I'd offer you advice about your quest, but right now I'm trying to figure out where this receipt came from. Whoever delivered that drooling buffoon statue over there must have dropped it. Anyway, if you're heading to the shop next door, please take this receipt with you. Okay, cool. And remember, if you ever lose your way, come see me for a free hint. Cool, maybe I can do that, like, later. Oh, Bolo. Guess I'm picking up Uncle's delivery. Or wait, like, I said that in, like, the wrong, like, tone. Like... Should have been like, oh, Bolo, that boy, that funny, like, stupid guy. Welcome to the item shop. We'll be open for business in just a few minutes. Oh, you're picking up for your uncle then? Just show me the receipt and I'll fetch it for you. Well, it's a good thing I visited Sky first, isn't it? So we could find out where that was. Okie dokie, let's see here. Yep. Here's his order. It was stuck to this box of hard drives. That... That cannot be... Good. And I got an achievement for that, apparently. There seems to be... A lot of running around... For this first bit. Ah, you have something for me? Sure. 
Ho ho, it's here. My magnet has finally arrived. That means it's time to show off my latest invention. Oh my, what is it, uncle? Something to help you defend the town. I call it the dynamo. Dino, meow. Fucking really? Dynamo. It's a contraption from the old world that I'm attempting to piece back together. That magnet you brought me goes right here, like that, you see? Once it's completed, this machine will generate enough electricity to light up Scuttle Town day and night. It'll chase away every monster and pirate within a 10 mile radius. Scuttle Town will be safe and sound. And you get to relax for a change. That's amazing, Uncle. When will it be ready? Well, there's still a few components missing, but I'm getting close. Next, I need to add a... Let's see here. Where are my dynamo blueprints? I had them last night, but now they're gone. Did you try looking in the basement? Basement? My workshop hasn't got one. But there's a trap door right in the... Oh, hey. Ah! A tinker bat. That filthy pirate just ran off with my blueprints. Don't worry, Uncle. I'll... Gee, was that? It sounds like... An intro stage is outside. Cannon fire? That blast came from Main Street. I've got to go. Ah, uh, she said it for me. I didn't even have to say it. You'll need a ride. Head to Sky's Hatchery quickly. Why, if, like, the town itself is, like, under attack? Like, can I just, like, walk into the background? Whatever, let's go talk to Sky. Sky! I heard it. Main Street is under attack. I'd give you a ride, but none of my birds... None of my birds is big enough. Good grammar. That is unless. Unless what? Wrench, I need you. Ready to show Shantae our newest trick? Mega Wrench Metamorphosis. Oh sh Gee, it's like that abandoned concept from that from the Game Boy Advance game they never made. How did he here? I got a whistle. A bird whistle? I'll explain later. Just get on already. Dude, like, for a Shantae game, this has, like, been the most epic that it's been screaming. Relax. Wrench can stay this size for several seconds. Seconds? Just choose the location and we'll drop you off. Okay. Pretty cool level select we got going. Main Street. Let's fucking hop right in. Sure, I'll save. Why not? He's. It saves. It reminds me of like how Super Paper Mario saved pretty quickly. Like that's like one of the only other games I know that that saved pretty quickly. This is your stop. Now about that bird whistle, I've added it to your subscreen. Okay. All of the items you collect can be found there. If you ever need a lift, go to your subscreen and blow that whistle. Got that? You bet. Now watch as I give those pirates a taste of my silky split ends of justice. Ugh, just go. I won't let you down. I won't let you down either. No, I mean, I'm literally not letting you down. Yet. Ouch, what, what is her deal? Was that, was that a loading screen? Oh shit, it's, it's the theme song. <laughs> There's, like, an obvious pirate ship in the back. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm already getting my ass kicked.
Like, I thought, I thought, like, a different version of Burning Town was supposed to play here. Like, I don't know what made them change their minds. But yeah, it was, like, pretty reminiscent of the first Shantae game so far. Because, like, there's... Oh, hang on a minute. Oh. Right, just like in the trailers. So you could push I knew you could push boxes and stuff. Ow. They're like they're throwing freaking Molotovs like the guys in the beginning of Pirate's Curse. Except these are Tinker Bats. It's like the only difference. Yeah, like, not that I'm com complaining that uh, Dance of the Danger is playing right now, but, like, thought a different version of Burning Town was supposed to play, like they originally intended. Can still swim, that's always nice to know. Saw you guys coming a mile away. Like, did you honestly think that would work? This, this whole fucking game just looks absolutely stunning. Like, I'm really taking in the visuals so far. Like, I knew it was going to look amazing, but it, lo it, ju it looks really amazing. It's locked at, like, a good, consistent 60 frames per second, so that's always nice for a game. It's you again. Uh, there's that, there's that remix I wanted to hear. It's like, I guess they just put it in a different place. Yeah, this is like very, like, reminiscent of the first game. Like, you got those blocks that switch and crap. Like... Who's that? Is that the girl from the second game? Like, how? What's she doing up there? Doesn't... Ah, shit. Well, it doesn't look like I can even get to her. Yeah, like... The, the song is living up to its name, Burning Town, because now the town actually does look like it's burning. What's with this? Like... What's with these flames defying the laws of physics, like, moving left and right? It's like some Super Mario shit. Can I even... I want those pots, de God damn it! They're, they're popping out of barrels like the fucking enemies in Wind Waker. Like, you can't do that shit. Oh wait, I was being stupid there. It's like, I'm just trying to concentrate on like, what's happening right now. Like, playing the entire Mega Man series has trained me for, like, these moments with these moving blocks. Can I break these? I can. There's pro like, there were some others I could, could have broken, like, earlier on in the level, but... So I guess I just missed out on something. 
I was like thinking there would be like some kind of secret or whatever. I don't know. I was actually pretty short. All of the pirates are tinker bats. No shit. Which means the person behind this attack must be. The fuck is that thing? <laughs> I didn't even have to say any of that. Tut tut, call me Queen of the Seven Seas, if you please. Back to your old tricks, I see. You don't sound happy to see me. No matter. I have what I came for. Uncle's blueprint. Your dim-witted relic hunting uncle is always unearthing valuables from the Lost Age. And whatever secrets this blueprint contains, I want them. How else can I claim my rightful place as ruler of all of Sequin land? Now step aside, or suffer the might of my part omni organic, partially titanic, ocean optimal, optional tinker slug. Poop toot. I want to turn this game off. There's a, there was a fucking fart joke at the beginning. Don't call it that. Men. Let's give this brat a proper workout. Seems like I won't have to be saying very much of the dialogue if there's going to be a lot of... Shit, what the fuck do I do? There's... Okay, there's like chains for me to climb, so I guess I have to go up here. Ow. Is it similar to, like, the Ammo Baron fight where I have to, like, deflect one of the cannonballs? I don't... I'm being such a noob, I don't get it. Oh, I see. Do I have... Something tells me if I, like... Okay, I thought... I was, that was like gonna explode in my face for a minute. It's like, I should have noticed this bell like way earlier. Like I'm not sure why I didn't before. Like I'm at like one more hit and I'm all like fucking dead. I have to be like extremely careful now. Like that's what I get for being a fucking noob at this game, holy. I... Wow. Okay. Thank God I can skip the cutscene. Let's go, Tinker Slug, round two. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I think I, I think I understood that the first time. See if I can't be a fucking noob now. So I'm, spo I'm supposed to be good at Shantae games. Here we go. It's my, I guess, like, I was just focusing on what the actual boss was doing instead of, like, thinking about what I can do to defeat it. Like, granted, I was in the mindset of, like, the first boss. I thought I was gonna have to, like, deflect the fireball at, like at its face or something. But now it was apparently something different. Yay. <laughs> like, even though this is like more advanced than Pirate's Curse and in HD, they still explode like Mega Man bosses. Surrender the blueprints, Risky Boots. So you've managed to get the upper hand. But you're only postponing my inevitable victory. 
got the dynamo blueprints. Another time run. Hey, how do you like that? I actually beat her right away for a change. I'd better get these blueprints back to Uncle. Hey, apparently warp pads just fucking appear out of thin air for now for some reason. So it said world clear, like... Apparently this game is going to be level-based. Daughter of the genies, welcome to the genie realm. Take this transformation and enter the light. You got the monkey dance. It's like a, li it's a little monkey, Shante. Use this power to scale walls. Press Y to dance. Okay, looks like I have to figure out how to do that. Oh, you can just you can just choose what you want to be now. You don't have to hold a button down anymore. That's no more stupid button comedy. Okay, I like this game now. No more no more stupid button combinations, no more having to hold the button down. I like this game now. This is a good game. You say Risky sailed off after that. She gave me the slip. I'm sorry, Uncle. There, there. Look on the bright side. No one was hurt, and you managed to return the blueprints. I was gonna say, like... Normally, Risky doesn't run away that quickly. Well, you're fired. Why, why am I fired, you fat fuck? Fired again? Yeah, Main Street is in shambles, and pirates are running pell-mell all over town. I'm off to place an ad for a new Guardian Genie. One who can get rid of those pirates for good. Lots of half-genies guarding towns these days. I thought I was the only half-genie. What the fuck is this shit? One of them's bound to want to transfer to a beach town. Free rent, amazing ocean view, negligible fish smell, apply today. I never got free rent. Bah, ignore him. He'll come around once this dynamo is completed. If you say so, uncle. In fact, I should get back to work right away. Why don't you see if anyone in town needs help? Alright, good luck, uncle. I'm ready to go. If anyone needs me. Of course, who wouldn't, who wouldn't need you? We got fired. Like a... That happened before in the second game. But it's not like we can... It's not like we can't still play the game. The gallery seems to have opened up. Why not take a look? When you turn into a monkey, does the food in your stomach change into monkey food? Gross. With a warp dance, you can get around much more quickly. Buy one at the item shop. Doesn't seem like anyone has much to say. The series I'm into can't tell if the latest version is a sequel, a reboot, soft reboot, a relaunch, or a soft robot rabbit. I'm so confused. I'm gonna turn this game off in a minute if I see another stupid joke like that. So you learned how to swim, you can't help but want to take a dip everywhere there's water. So, like, something tells me... I'm gonna learn how to swim. Who are you? It, it's terrible. Someone please help me. All the young maidens from my village, they've disappeared. I heard that a guardian genie lived in this town. You must be her. Please, will you help my village? Yes, you can count on it. Oh, thank you, thank you. Here's a map to Mermaid Falls. Cool. You'll need to fly there and quickly, before more young maidens vanish. So let's check out this art gallery real quick. Like, I know I, I know I have, like, a job to do and stuff. But it's like... Okay, so this is like... You, 
can just like view art and stuff from the game. Locked, of course. How terrible. I lost all ten gallery keys while I was out traveling the world. Since you're out of the job, how about you go find them for me? Okay, well, I'm glad you gave me something to do. It's like I... It's like I stopped Risky Boots and you still fire me, like... I just... I don't like that guy. I s still... I just... I don't like him. It's like, I did, I did well enough, like, can you give me a fucking break for once? There's what I was looking for. This is a map to Mermaid Falls. Are you going there? Looks that way. Well, be careful. Mermaids around those parts can be very dangerous, especially the saltwater variety. They won't get the drop on me. After all, I'm the town's guardian G. Hold it. I'd like to introduce you to someone. Oh, it's this girl from, like, the previews and stuff. Hello, who are you? Oh, you don't know? I'm your replacement, of course. Holly Lingerbean, half-genie hero for hire. But you can call me Holly. Your mom was a genie? That's right. And my dad was a stage magician. So I'm more magical than any other half-genie by far. Ha! Huh. Babies don't work that way. It's true. She stole my nose and removed her own thumb while I watched. As our old guardian genie, I'd like you to show her the ropes. Me? No big whoop, Mare. I'm sure I'll j be just fine without her. Later, Tiny Tater. I can't believe he actually did it. Now hold on. He replaced me with that. Snotty. Little. Now, now, you don't have to get all competitive. Besides, you're on a mission, remember? I guess you're right. Okay then, off to Mermaid Falls. You ready to lift off? Yes. Okay. Let's go.